Yeah, it's that kind of place? Yeah, never know what this place. Okay. You got keys? My sister was married to Nicholas Castanine. You, uh, you probably know your way around the place pretty good, then. Yeah, somewhat. Yeah. Just would have brought a six-pack to be a decent fella. So what do we know so far? Huh? Alexis Davis, she gets a call. Telling her to do a walkthrough after a break-in, except there was no break-in, and the security company's got no record of the call. Somebody wanted Alexis out here. Exactly. But who? All right, from what Sam said, Alexis passed out in this room. So how do Alexis and Jocelyn contract the same disease at the same time in opposite sides of the town? I don't know, but I don't believe for a second that Jocelyn left the house on her own. Agreed. So someone broke into Carly's house and they took Jocelyn. The question is, what was the point? I, uh, I got a call from the security company. Um, said there was some kind of break-in. Uh, I've got some stuff in storage here, and I just wanted to, to check if anything was missing. Uh, is, is that what you guys are doing here? Oh, well, it's a little more complicated than that, Doc. Alexis Davis got a similar call last night. She came out here and had a seizure. Had another one again this morning. Really? Uh, is she going to be all right? She's been admitted to the hospital. <gasps> so is a little girl named Jocelyn They have the same symptoms. What about you, Dr. Keenan? You feeling sick? Well, you and Alexis both got calls from the security company, right? Right. Well, the calls were bogus. There was no alarm tripped. The security company confirmed that they never made those calls. Well, uh, wait, I'm not sure I, I quite follow you. Well, what's the point of having all those diplomas, Doc? I mean, obviously someone tried to lure Alexis here. Since you got a call, they were trying to lure you here, too. Do you have any idea who would want to do that? So what kind of personal items you think the doc left behind? It's wouldn't have been real important, considering he rushed off like that, didn't even bother to check on them. You notice how he wasn't real concerned when he found out the calls from the security company were bogus? Because he's lying. Of course he's lying. The question is, why is he lying? We need to find out what the doc's hiding, and how does it relate to Jocelyn and Alexis? Since this place has been occupied. Uh, Nicholas has been gone for more than a year, and Keenan moved out a few months ago. Doesn't exactly feel abandoned, does it? I mean, either these people have a world-class caretaker or someone else has been here. Let's start looking around. Yeah. Then again, it could be disease central. You know, it might be nice if we had a doctor with us, you know, a real doctor before we go any further. You want to call the CDC? That's a good call. Might take them a little long to get here. I'd sell for anyone you knew in Port Charles. It's good with contaminants and biohazards. You know any? Excuse me. McBain. All right, I'm on my way. It was Atlantic City District Attorney. Someone is pressing for a hearing to arrange for Joe Scully's release. So you knew there was a chance this could happen? Yeah, I did. The alternative was let Sonny blow his brains out. That would have been justice. But it would have got all of my new suit. And that's not justice. That's murder. Look, if there's a virus here, we should come back with professionals, you guys with masks and stuff like that. And quite frankly, the Atlantic City DA, they need me there about 10 minutes ago. Can you take me back to the mainland? You can't swim? Let's go. I need to see Joe Scully Jr. He and his buddy just left. On his way to the hearing? Got a straight release. On a murder rap. How the hell does that happen? Tell me about it. Scully's friend walks right in here, and before you know it, the guy's walking Scully right out. Free as a bird. I'm trying to understand this. <clears throat> Someone gave Jocelyn a shot? That appears to be the case. I don't want to hear what it appears to be. I want to know why my kid's sick. What happened? I'm trying to get Steve to tell me. He's saying someone injected Jocelyn with a chemical. You're saying the mark on her arm was from an injection? Yeah, Alexis, too. They think it might be the same thing. Well, how do you treat it? I'm sorry. At this point, we don't have a protocol. You can't make my little girl better? Yeah, we're doing everything we can for Jocelyn and Alexis. But at this point, all we know is it appears to be intentional. You're saying somebody did this on purpose? 